Hey everybody, this is Jordan with PDQ.com, and today we're going to talk about the zero logon vulnerability. It's kind of a good news, bad news scenario. Uh, the bad news is this one is a 10 out of 10 on the CVSS scale. It's about as bad as an uh, exploit that's ever been found. The good news is Secura, who found it, did everybody solid and they waited a month after the patch was out before they released the white papers on how bad this really is. Uh, so if you're up to date on your patching, your patch, this is, it's kind of a two phase patch. The patch now is kind of an immediate fix where it does a lot of the protections and then February 2021 is the expected second half of the patch that's coming out. Um, but yeah, Secura waited a month after the update. Uh, they didn't have to. I thought that was awesome. I think everyone should send them a love letter. Let, let them know how great they are because if this got out there before the patch, who knows what can be taken over. And we'll just kind of break down why, it, why it's so bad. Uh, basically, if anyone can get a TCP connection in your environment, someone that's there and can plug in or uh, someone's working for you that uh, just not just not happy looking to cause some, some damage. Uh, well, you can take advantage of a cryptographic protocol and you can spoof as yourself as any machine uh, in there and it'll just accept it. So you could say, I am the domain controller and reset the password right there. And so in a matter of seconds, that person is now the sole domain controller. You're locked out because they've changed that password on you. Uh, of your system, you lose your entire environment. It's, this one is, it's super bad. <laughs> it's, uh, so th if you want more information from Secura, if you go to their blog, which we have a link in our blog, they have a white page, and you can really break down the dive into it in there. If you have the patch and you're still uh, concerned that you're maybe a bit vulnerable, there is a GitHub link out there, which we'll put in our comments below. I'm going to point down here, like, like it's already there. Comments below. Uh, not comments, description, description below, where you can run that. It's a Python script that lets you know if your domain controller is exposed or not. Uh, so if you've, if you've patched, great. Uh, you're still not comfortable, run the GitHub. If you're not patched, it's more important than ever that you patch that one because now that this is known, uh, that it's just a huge vulnerability for everybody. Uh, for PDQ.com, I'm Jordan.